Welcome back. In 2003, Claire Huddleston started <laughs> as a student intern here at WVUA TV. I was Claire Stewart at that point. You were, you were Claire Stewart then. She's been bringing news to us for a while, and she has one more important story for us today on First at Four. Claire? Well, today is my last day. Um, some people, some of our viewers might have seen that on Facebook, um, but I'm really going to miss everyone here at WVUA. And I've made some great friends, um, and I'll always cherish the friendships that I've made, but um, just going on to a different opportunity at this point. All right, super. Claire, I took some time this morning, and I put a little something <laughs> together for you. I hope you enjoy it. I apologize in advance for the music. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead and roll it. The new road will begin on Hospital Drive and wind its way through this neighborhood, ending on Highway 69. Now, residents are not happy about moving, but some believe that it will bring economic growth to the area. Although Kimberly Corr lives in Northport, the Northport Police Department is not the agency handling the case, and they were unavailable for comment today. This is the intersection at Fairmont Road and Highway 82 where many fatalities have occurred because cars flying over the hill don't have enough time to see the cars crossing the intersection. Now the community is rallying together to have this changed. Either the hill be leveled off or the intersection moved back. Walking on the treadmill is a good way to lose those extra pounds to put on over Thanksgiving. And with the holidays just around the corner, health experts say many people will stop going to the gym altogether. But they advise against that. They say if you normally go about four times a week, maybe cut it back to two, but make sure you get into the gym. In this week's edition of Community Character, we'll introduce you to two groups who are giving back to the community in a way they describe as a mutual partnership. Here's try number one. This is actually one of my better kicks. That can hurt my toes. I guess you can say beginner's luck. As you can see, the devastation is just enormous. Words really can't describe it. People are sifting through what's left of their homes and cars, and they're trying to figure out the next step. Thanks for joining us tonight. The city of Tuscaloosa is pushing forward with tornado relief efforts. Today, the Tuscaloosa City Council had a public hearing concerning properties that have been deemed a public nuisance. And I, I noticed that she has one blue eye and one brown eye. Tell us about that. I couldn't tell you more than you already know. <laughs> oh, my gosh. There you go. And it's a real bottle. Real bottle, real cap. It's an IBC root beer I got right out here in your lobby. Wow. We need to give him a round of applause, everyone in the studio. Wow. And we've been talking about our awards because we both got them this week. And all I have to say is mine is bigger. <laughs> That's not nice. Mine's more prestigious. I'm not injured. Okay. I fell um, into the chair as I was sitting down. She fell. And that's what that loud noise was you probably heard. So. That was a definite crash. <laughs> And get the bullet out. <clears throat> We'd be doing an hour long special on this station <laughs> about me getting shot in my hand. Make oh, no mistake. I would cry, Danny. You never give up, and uh, Claire, I've worked with you for a long time. I know. <sighs> I'm gonna miss you. I'm gonna miss you too. And uh, there's a whole bunch of people here who've come to. Uh, right, we cry I know. Now. I can't help it. Uh, this was come a no to say at you. first. It was. It was supposed to be, but I'm being a big baby. So uh, everybody, just come on in. These are uh, a lot of our friends from the community who have worked really closely oh with gosh. Claire for a long time. They just wanted to come by and uh, and say goodbye Thank you to so you, much. Northport Thank Mayor you. Bobby Hearn. If we could roll the happy music, oh that gosh, would make I me be earlier. happy.
everybody. Thank you.